In this video, we are going to discuss clutch adjustments. The brake is already on the input shaft. We slide the transmission into the clutch and we're looking for two measurements. Measurement number one will be the eighth of an inch between the throwout bearing and fork. What this eighth of an inch does is gives us our free play inside the cab. The next measurement we are looking for is the half inch between the throwout bearing and brake. This measurement is for full release on the clutch. With that being said, how do we set a clutch brake? This takes two mechanics. One mechanic will step on the pedal till he's one inch off the floor. At one inch off the floor, I should be able to take a 10 thousandths feeler gauge and have the space between the throwout bearing and brake. If this measurement is not right, I will adjust the linkage to set it. What this does is it makes the driver go all the way to the floor to squeeze the clutch brake. Clutch brake is only made for first and reverse. To get our half inch measurement and to adjust the clutch for wear, we will put our 5 8 socket on our adjuster after the clutch is fully released, taking the pressure off the pressure plate, and we just turn. Nothing to push in or take out, just turn. It automatically locks.